I've got like a killer sore throat right now. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. All I can say is I hate kachiki. You just get sick on it and it's just like, never again. Last one ever. Yeah, last one. Yeah. Good, we're at in Pisa. Have to see some tower. Yeah. Famous moving home. Yeah, I, I don't. I'll go into it later, but I, I don't understand. The only thing that's cool, essentially, it's just like shitty architecture. Someone's like, I'm gonna build it. Someone's like, I'm gonna build a tower on unstable ground. We're here. Yeah, but the buildings around it look so much cooler, don't they? Anyway, it's a tower that was built on shitty ground, so it's hard to fall, and it's not even falling anymore. No, it so that's not really cool anymore, is it? So I got slightly interrupted. Um, Sorry, can you write your name on my t-shirt? Uh, why? Because <laughs> this is... Uh, 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 sure. Okay, you write um, 25. 26. 26? And your name. Okay. Okay. When you, when you, <laughs> I feel weird, but it's fine. That was confusing. It's like you wonder whether it's like some sort of scam or something like that. No, there's tons of people doing it though. I think it's like a school group around. Anyway, she was like, oh, you can just write it here. She's like literally holding it right below her chest. And I'm like, um, no. <laughs> no, I'll write it on your back where I feel a bit more comfortable. <laughs> like, I know there's like a whole bunch of stuff leading to the like leading to the tower. I think these buildings are cooler. See how these towers, are, like these buildings aren't falling over? It's good architecture and it's a solid building and I'll come to see it. And this must be the spot where you get your like, touristy photo. Everyone's like looking to hold it up. Right here. It looks so stupid when it's like not in frame of it. <laughs> this is my awesome photograph. Terrible footage here, but because of the reflection. I thought it was funny to take a photo of the tower being straight. I've just never seen so many people doing that dumb pose ever. It's like just hundreds of people just doing that dumb pose. <laughs> it's hilarious. I went out of frame, you look so dumb. <laughs> so I think they challenge like there's a bunch of people doing the different challenges. And I think it's like high five people while they're doing that dumb pizza pose. Because if you put your hands up, people just run along and high five you. It's hilarious. So if you see that building it's also like sinking into the ground because it's kind of on an angle so I feel like this whole area is just like the area of shitty architecture and shitty engineering and that's what I call it we're in Florence um, I don't know my hood up to try to look cool it's just um, it's really sunny <laughs> I'm trying to keep it off my face and so it's actually quite warm in the Sun I think we have to go to and I say we have to <laughs> We have to go to another leather working thing. And if you've been watching our vlogs, you would have seen we went to one in Morocco. And it wasn't that exciting. I might give it a pass. So I might just sit outside and let it smell leather. Again, because it's actually quite gross. Um, no, the one in Morocco wasn't so bad because they gave us mint. Yeah, so like, as you saw, we're smelling mint leaves. Yeah, that was fine, but I don't think it was bad. Anyway, um, doing that and then there's like a walking tour but I'm not going to do the walking tour with the group because there's nothing worse than walking around with like 50 people you're not going to learn anything we're better off exploring ourselves Florence is really famous for, for art and there's the gallery but you see a gallery it's closed on Mondays and today's Monday so annoying that's where the um, Michelangelo statue of David is yeah, if anyone like, doesn't know what it is like yeah, like the birth of Venus yeah so, I'm kind of about that. Anyway, we've got like 10 minutes to walk before we get into town because the bus can't drop us off in there. And I'm not too excited about it because <laughs> I feel like crap. Like, you know, the start of a cold where you just feel really bad? That's me right now, and I am not having fun. I don't know, we're up to a pharmacy to get um, some cold and flu tablets for me. And right next, to right next to it, there's this like, massive line on the street. And there's, there's this two massive lines, because there's two shops. Yeah, there's, there's two restaurants the same, like on both sides of the street. Um, probably overlay some of the line. Um, and it's like for a restaurant, and we're like, huh, must be good if everyone's lining up, so we just jumped in line and we looked it up. 
and Sally said it's what? Apparently, the number three most reviewed restaurant in the world. In the world. Apparently. Apparently. I don't, Apparently. Know. I don't, I don't know. know if that's true, but. I don't know how true that is, but we're going to see what it's all about. See, on both sides, all these people are actually in line, and where that flashing pharmacy thing is, beyond that is where the restaurant is. The 10 most reviewed restaurants worldwide, or at least on TripAdvisor. This place in Portugal, this place in New Orleans, which I've been to actually, it's pretty good. And this place. So close now. We're almost inside at least. To La Favelosa. Uh, with zucchini as well. Hmm, how good does that look? It sounds like La Favelosa. So, got, what's in it? Um, salami. Uh, Pecorino, Pecorino cheese. cheese. Spicy eggplant, spicy eggplant and, and artichoke we added, spread. Oh yeah, and we added in grilled spicy no, yeah, yeah, grilled zucchini. I thought spicy as well. Mm. The right, battery's salami. flashing. Okay, salami is good. So our battery is like partially dying, so this is going to be like a pretty, really quick tour of Florence. We're going to have a short time here anyway, so it's fitting. This looks like something. It's a Ponte Vecchio. This is a famous bridge. Famous bridge. And this is the Arno River. Okay, let's continue our whirlwind tour of Florence. I was going to say Nice, but it's Florence. We're at the Piazza de Michelangelo. Piazza de Michelangelo. Replica of Michelangelo's David. We actually can't see it today because the museum's closed. This is our awesome view from up at the plaza here. It's on top of a hill on the other side. We were over there before and we walked across the river and all the way up. And it is a spectacular view from up here. Okay, didn't complain once. I didn't complain once. I'm sick. So where are we? It's like a Tuscan evening. Tuscan uh, evening. Some random Italian restaurant. <laughs> it is a random Italian restaurant. There's no one else here. Kippini's new leather jacket. <laughs> Tell me about the leather jacket. What did you learn at your leather jacket making thing? What encouraged you to buy this leather jacket? That was expensive. Normally means it's good. You know what else makes things good? You have to wait for it too. If there's a line, it's normally good. It is true. It looks good though. Actually, and it wasn't on camera. 